Hi, I'm Kim, the winemaker for The Love Block. Uh, today we're tasting Pinot Gris. To me, good Pinot Gris, Pinot Grigio. You still got to have, it's, it's a, to me it's an aromatic variety. Um, being a member of the Pinot Noir, or Pinot family, I think it is much better with a year or two in the bottle. So these wines are all aged for a year before release. Um, aromatically, the, the wine to me almost has a wildflower characteristic to it and sort of underscored with a little bit of Turkish delight and a, and a little bit of a lychee type characteristic coming in. Again it's got some really nice ripe fruit characteristics but in similarity to the Sauvignon it's got a beautiful piercing minerality which comes through at the back. The wine's almost dry it's got 0.2 percent sugar in it so it's very very dry for, a, for the style of Pinot Gris but I think because of the the weight and the acidity in the mouthfeel, it's fantastic with food. It'll lift the flavours in your food quite nicely. It will go with any white, white flesh dish, I would say. It'll be quite nice just by itself in the afternoon, but it's more a, a complement wine-wise to the food. This would be ideal with crab or sea fish or seafood or anything like that. So.